The school has over a thousand students and 75 teachers and staff members. This means that planning for and practicing emergency drills is a complicated process. When our school participated in the Great California Shakeout, we noticed that our teachers had to remember a lot of different things to do in an emergency. She walks down. What are we supposed to do? We thought that an app could help our school handle emergencies better. We met at lunch every other day while we worked on our proposal. First, we collaborated on a slideshow for the school staff, which we presented at a meeting. Okay, good afternoon. I would like to introduce you to our app team. I'm Anthony, and this is Mason, Travis, Jesus, Emmanuel, Edgar, and Nisi. We are working together to create a mobile app for the Verizon Initiative App Challenge. Some of us teachers are like dinosaurs that don't have those things. What about us? In a perfect world, schools should give all teachers <laughs> So if many teachers are able to access this app during an emergency, that would improve on our current system. For the staff that we would need their feedback on how we could better prepare for emergencies. Using a Google form, we surveyed the staff to find out what problems they saw with our current drills. We analyzed their responses, first by separating the problems into categories tried to figure out how an app could help solve this problem. We took into consideration the different kinds of emergencies we might have. Okay, what type of disasters are there, Jesus? Pues los disasters que hay es terremotos. Uh -huh. Como si la escuela. The jobs that teachers need to do. Where the supplies would be kept and would be responsible for them. The medical issues that might come up. Where parents would pick up students and how everyone would be able to communicate, teachers to teachers and administration to parents. We named our app Respond.com because we want teachers to be able to respond calmly during school emergencies. We know that lives depend on it.